Yeah. That's an artist. 2011. Four years. Four years. Four years in October. And what's your name? Is my name? Yeah. David. Thanks, David. So the truck eating bridge uh, strikes again. We might get a live feed. We're thinking about it. Oh, really? The action of everybody. That'd be interesting. Live feed on the North Cape Arts Council website. I think it's slowed down though, the truck's uh, smashing into this. We've been uh, trying to enact some measures so that does. Uh, I think if we just have Google Maps, not let the truckers use Google Maps, it would actually probably circumvent the truck eating bridge from being fed. You know what else? They could dig this road down like another foot or two and leave the sign up, you know. They can't do anything with the bridge, but. Uh, we, see, we thought how we installed the sculpture. Do you see how there's about a foot of relief from the actual bridge? Yeah. We thought that would not uh, have an issue with damaging the bridge. But since the trucks hit the bridge, what we didn't account for is the tin, the, um, the like tin can effect of the trailer o opening it up, opening up and damaging the top of the bridge. Which, I mean, the, the sculpture. What's your name? I'm Brian Foote. Uh, Peter McFarlane is the production assistant for the North Haven Arts Council. Steve Sanderson is the arts event producer for the North Haven Arts Council. Joey Pesci is a sculptor slash musician slash artist. David Peoples is a local fantastic artist who focuses on water. Um, kind of like a social activist artist. And I'm Brian Foote. I'm the director of the Arts Council. Cool. That's quite a little rig, that thing. It looks it's a little, a little scary. Thank you. 